It's Monday, October 1st, 2018. What's news? Congratulations, Raiden Wilson, for correctly answering the library's question of the week. Please come, claim your prize. Look for our new question to test your luck and skill. Ben and choir members are selling fresh fudge as a fundraiser for their trip to New York City. Twelve flavors are available. Fudge orders are due Tuesday, October 9th. All students that will be representing WGHS at the fair in either special events, tug of war, road race, or cheerleading, you will be excused at 1.45 p.m. Please come to the large gym at that time for further instructions and organization. Come help us set up and decorate for tomorrow's fair day. Join us from 4 to 6.30 p.m. Remember to wear your school colors. University Information Fair at SES is October 3rd. University of Windsor will be here October 11th at 1.45. Please arrive in school colors tomorrow at the fair at 8 a.m. The judging starts early and we want to fill our stands. Remember that all bags will be searched and you cannot bring your own drinks into the fair. There's a fast track lane for individuals that do not bring along a bag. All students will get in free for, all students will get in for free tomorrow and there's no fair pass required. Cross country will be canceled tonight due to the road race practice at the fairgrounds. All road race runners are reminded to come to the track by 4.30 if they want to get in some runs before practice. We are hosting awards and ceremonies Friday, October 5th. That's this Friday. Today's Monday? That's Friday. Award presentations for the evening of recognition begins at 6 and commencement begins at 8. All award winners are asked to come to the cafeteria an hour and a half before. Please check the award list winners posted outside the main office to see if you're receiving an award this year after evening a recognition ceremony at 6 p.m. You should expect to receive an invitation early this week. If you do not receive one, please check down in guidance to obtain yours. If you suspect any errors in the award list, please see Ms. Domich or Ms. Cheney immediately. Hoops for Heart is scheduled for next Friday. Want to participate? We need a minimum of six teams. In order to, for the tournament to run, permission forms must be handed in by this Friday. This Friday. If you want to play. Bye. <laughs> yeah, marker. Congratulations, Braden Wilson, for correctly answering the library's question. Yeah! <laughs>